Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be sharing with you the Lancome Christmas release that they do every year. And this is uh, like a trunk, it's a, it's a makeup case and it brings an eyeshadow and face palette. It's all in one. Two different lipsticks um, and everything is full size. It's worth $555 and you get it for $72.50 with a uh, $42 purchase, I think it is. Now, I did get it through Macy's, and they're having a 15% off, plus Rakuten was 10%, uh, and I think it still is from Macy's. Okay, so it brings a full-size eyelash primer, the Denificils, um Mascara, which is one of my least favorite ones. It brings a full-size eye makeup remover, which I really love. It's an excellent eye makeup remover it even works on stubborn lipstick like liquid lipsticks that you can't take off this will help you take that off and then it brings the uh, Lancome Genifique this is the uh, face serum and eye serum that is also moisturizing for your eyelashes and an eye cream now these three products I will not be using because they do have denatured alcohol and I don't use denatured alcohol on my face but even with taking these three products out of the equation, this is a wonderful, wonderful bargain. Their lipsticks are like $32. This is the eye primer is $26.50. The mascara is $27.50. This is $30 right here. And um, I don't know what this will be valued at, but I mean, it has to be at least worth $50 or $60 because it's actually really nice quality. Sorry about that. That was my dad's phone. He's not here. He went to the doctor with my dad, with my husband. So this is a really good buy. I get it every year because definitely I love their lipsticks and I love, in the past I haven't been very happy with their eyeshadows that they include in their Christmas kits, but this one's a good one. This is what I'm wearing. So if you'd like to see how I created this entire look, just keep on watching. Okay guys, so we're going to create a look with everything that I received in the uh, Lancome. This is their Christmas release and they release one of these every year. And this is worth $555 and it's $72.50 with any $42 purchase. So I'm going to show you the two things that I did purchase in order to buy this. And then we're going to create a look with all of the, um, all of the products except for the skincare. I already have skincare on and um, it's not Lancome. That is the one thing that I don't use because it does have denatured alcohol. The Eye Pearl, which is um, a serum for your eyes and it's also supposed to be good for your lashes. It moisturizes, moisturizes, moisturizes your lashes. It's $70 and denatured alcohol is the seventh ingredient in. This is like a almost a five star review on their website the eye cream is also everything is full size this is the genifique advanced eye cream this is 67 dollars it has uh four and a half stars and the alcohol is also the denatured alcohol is the seventh ingredient in and then the genifique uh advanced concentrate serum this is 78 dollars this is the one ounce and the denatured alcohol is the fourth ingredient and this is a five star review so um i mean i choose not to use denatured alcohol on my face so i really don't know what i'm going to do with these i may use it like on my elbows or i, I may i don't know because i even hate to give it to anybody else if i don't like to put it on my face all right so then the other thing that it came in here is the eye makeup remover and this is Okay, this is $30 for this size. The uh, Seals Booster, which is for your uh, lashes. Now, I'm not going to use this one because I have one that's open. So, I'm going to use mine, the one that's already open. The Seals Booster is $26.50. The Deficils, or the Finicils Mascara is $27.50 and it says it's, it's uh, clean defined natural lashes and that's why I don't like it because I like for my lashes to look volumized and to look you know to have lashes and I'm gonna try it today but I know the last time I tried this I really didn't care for it and then the eyeshadow palette I really don't know what they would value it at but it, it is a full face I'll show you in a second it has eyeshadows and 
um, blushes and concealer and uh, also a bronzer. And then the lipsticks, uh, each one of them is $32, and we get two of them. So, I mean, even if I take away the things that I'm not going to use, which is the three um, skincare, I am definitely got my money's worth. So, because just the lipstick alone is almost what you pay for the entire box. So, you really do get a good value whenever you can get this box on the during the holidays. Now, I'm going to show you what I purchased I love their blushes. Their blushes will last you forever. Um, they're very pigmented and you only need a little bit. And they always look beautiful on the skin. I got this one. I don't have the shade. And this is in something Tresor, I know. Blushing Tresor. And it's so pretty. It's like a pink, but it has some coral in it, and it does have a little bit of a glow, but it looks very, very pretty. Another one that I really love is the um, Havana, something Havana. And that one is more like a brownie tone, but it looks so pretty on the skin. It really is a pretty one. I do have that one. And then I have been eyeing this palette for a long time. They also included a brush, which I'm not going to, price it because the blushes are normally come in these you know gift packages or whatever are not the best i'm going to try to maybe well i don't know what i can use it on but if i can i will but i have been eyeing this eyeshadow um quad or no it's five for a while i think this is beautiful and i finally got it so and macy's was having a 15 percent off Plus, I got it through Rakuten that was 10% for Macy's at the time. So, I, I feel like I got a pretty good deal. All right. So, the only thing that I have on my face, I do have all my makeup on except for anything that comes in here. Um, my foundation is not a Lancome foundation, but the powder is a Lancome powder. And this is the translucent, the long time no shine translucent powder. This is a really nice powder. So I do have that on, and this is what the palette looks like. These are, let me take the mirror, the uh, little plastic off the mirror. Okay, it does have a nice mirror, and then these are the shadows, which they look very pretty. And then when you slide out the bottom, you get two blushes, one highlighter, and one bronzer. So I'm going to start with my uh, eyes. And I look, let me fix my light because it looks a little too bright. Hold on. Okay, I think that's a little better. I was really washed out. I kind of look like a ghost. So most of the brushes that I'm going to be use are, are using are Refer or Sigma brushes. And I'm going to start with this color right here. They don't have any shades on here. So, And the primer that I am using is the Gerard Cosmetics. You know what first of all I'm gonna set it I didn't set it and I do love that primer but you definitely do have to set it because it does crease on me and I don't put a lot a little goes a long way so I'm gonna set it with this shade right here that primer it looks your la your lashes your um, shadows last all day they really do cover any kind of veining or redness that you may have on your uh, on your lids and I did bring a little clip with me in case my hair was started getting in the way so I'm just put this on because I can't stand to have hair in my eyes when I'm trying to do them all right so we're going to start with this one right here and it look, it's almost like, um, it's got like a little bit, yeah, you can see it, like a little bit of a lavender to it. It's really pretty. So far, so good. Usually, I'm not really impressed with the shadows that they include in these uh, holiday, but maybe they're doing better now. Let's see. So far, this one is going really nice. Um, there's not really any kick up in the palette so far okay should have brought two clips maybe
Okay guys, so now I am going to do my lips and these are the two choices of lipsticks that I have. This one, which is a very pretty nude. And this one here, and let me see if I can read the names. The first one is Natural Beauty. And the second one is Red Stiletto. I don't think I'm going to use the Red Stiletto. Um, I'm just not feeling the red. So I'm going to use a Natural Nude. And I did bring some um, Lancome lip liners with me. They're some of my favorite lip liners. So I think I'm going to use this one. It's the lightest one that I brought. And I'm going to fill my lips and then put the lipstick over it because this is a very light nude and when i wear very light nudes i look pretty dead the shade on this one is charm c-h-a-r-m-e their lips their lip liners are very creamy and effortless So it's a very pretty lip liner. I love Estee Lauder and as far as high end, I love the Estee Lauder lipsticks and the Lancome lipsticks. They're really, really nice. The double wear from Estee Lauder. All right, and then let's put the lipstick on. It's a very pretty shade and I think it goes well with the um, eye look. Now how do I feel about the products? I thought that the eyeshadows were pretty nice. Actually in the past whenever I've had um, an eyeshadow palette from that comes in their Christmas kits, I haven't been very happy with it. But I thought all of these worked fine. Um, I think they did a good job. I really didn't have any fallout. There was a little bit of a, of a, you know, product on the pan whenever I dipped, but not very much because you guys know that I go very lightly on my eyeshadows. Um, I used the brown and the black. I used this one here. I used this one, this one, and this one, and this one. So I used quite a few of them. Um, I think they're very pretty. Let me try putting this like right here this is like a topper see i have shadows all over my hand okay the mascara i mean i know i like the the lash primer because i've used that before i've used it for years and i know that i like it the mascara was okay um it does give you natural lashes if that's what you like me personally i like more of a volume on my eyes uh i like a little more you know for them to be thicker to be longer i did two coats of this and this is with a primer and um, this is the most that i can get out of this um out of this mascara so this is one that I would wear like if I'm going to be around the house or something and I don't need anything huge but um I mean that looks like it's building up a little bit this is like the third coat okay it looks like with the third coat it built up a little bit but normally with the hypnos um hypnos drama or with the uh monsieur big you don't have to do that two coats and you're done and for some reason, my right eye always turns out better than my left eye. My lashes, my eyeshadow, I don't know why, but it is. So I did build a little more. I mean, you can barely see on my lower lashes that I have anything on, but it's okay. I do like the, the uh, shadows. I thought the, um, the, the bronzer is very light, but that's fine. I don't like anything that's going to make my face look like I'm, you know, I have dirt on my face and I do that if I wear anything that's very dark 
I thought the um, highlighter is very nice. You can see it, but it's not, I mean, you can build it up, I'm sure. I think that the blush looks pretty. I used this one here. Let's try a little bit of the other one on top and see what it does. It's pretty. It's um, has like a little bit of a shimmer, but it's not, you know, it's not glittery or anything like that. But I think it looks pretty. I like it. I think it looks very nice. So anyway, overall, I'm very happy with my kit. I even enjoy the palette, which is amazing because I never, like I say, I never do. So about the only things that I would not use are these three things. And that's just because it's a matter of preference. I do not like using the nature alcohol on my 65 year old face. Um, I probably used it many, many times in the past. I used to use this as skincare, but that was before I was aware of um, products or ingredients in my products. Ever since I found out, I really don't like using it on my skincare. Now, sometimes if I have like a foundation or something that has it, I don't have my foundation on right on my face. I have a few layers underneath it and I don't wear it every day. So I do wear it if it's not like, you know, the right on the very top. But if it does have it on any of my makeup, I do use it but not on my skincare. So anyway, guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think. Are you going to get this kit? I love the case. The case is so pretty and it's very, very hand, you know, handy. And you didn't see me unbox it because this is a second take on this. But this is a beautiful, beautiful, and definitely a great value. You know, if you like Lancome, if this is something that you look for every year, I love it. I really do like the products. I think I was able to create a very nice look with it. So let me know what you think. Let me know if you got it or if you're going to get it. Okay, I love you guys. Bye. Mwah.